Assalamu alaikum. Hi everyone. My name is Zain and you are watching my YouTube channel Learn Math. In today's video, I will solve this question. But before starting, like the video and if you are new on my channel, please subscribe it. Let's begin to solve the question. In this question, there are three circles inside a rectangle and we have to find the length of AB. Let the first circle is C1 and the diameter of this circle is 3. The second circle is C2 and the diameter of this circle is 4. And the third circle, the largest circle is C3 and the diameter of this largest circle is 6. This is the largest circle so the width of the rectangle is also 6. So the radius of the first circle is 1.5 because the diameter is 3. The radius of the second circle is 2 because the diameter is 4 and the radius of the third circle is 3. Now from C1 to C2 this line will be 1.5 plus 2 so this will be 3.5. Why? Because this is 1.5 and this is 2. So the whole length C1, C2 is 3.5. So parallel to this we will take ED and that will be also 3.5. This line, this will be also 3.5. Now extend D to E perpendicular on AB and this will be 6 minus 1.5 minus 2, that is 2.5. Now this is a right angle triangle. So if we solve this right angle triangle, we will get AE is equal to square root of AD square minus DE square is equal to square root of 6. Now look at the other two circles from C1 to C3 this will be equal to 2 plus 3 and that is 5. So parallel to C2, C3 we will take a point F on ED such that BF is parallel to C2, C3 and that length will be also equal to 5 and EF will be equal to 6 minus 2 minus 3 and that is 1 and this is also a right angle triangle so if we solve this right angle triangle we can write eb is equal to square root of bf square minus ef square and this is equal to 200 root x so ab is equal to the length of ab is equal to ae plus eb that is equal to 300 root 6 which is approximately equal to 7.3456 and this is the required length of AB. Like the video, share with your friends and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you.